Thank you. And the most important thing that I'm called to do as a father is leading them in family worship. Our God and our Father, we give thanks to you, for you have fed us, and now you are about to feed us with your word. So give us open ears. In family worship, you're not only able to fulfill the commandments in Ephesians 5 and Ephesians 6 about washing your wife with the word and training your children in the ways of the Lord, but you get to do both at the same time. I remember what we learned in Psalm 1? Go to Psalm 1 for a minute. Can I read it? And so what we do in family worship is I pray, we then read a passage. Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the wicked, nor stands in the way of sinners. I explain it to the children and to my wife. Some choose to live by faith, and they choose to hear the word of God. And then we sing. And Holy Ghost, Amen. Family worship generally lasts about 10 to 15 minutes. It prepares them to be able to sit still and participate in corporate worship. One of the reasons why family worship is so important is because as fathers, we're commanded to pass down the faith to our children. How does God justify God forgives all my sins and accepts me as righteous through Christ. Very good. How does God sanctify you? God makes me more and more holy in heart and conduct.